Imagine giving birth with no one with you to help you. A Kansas City woman essentially delivered her own baby, and now she wants to give credit to the first responder who helped save her and her son's life seconds later. 41 Action News reporter Josh Helmut is live with this story. Josh. Yeah, Mike, you know, for most of us, uh, one would, this home here, it'd be the last place one would want to give birth in any home, especially without a trained professional there on staff. So first responders walking into this home yesterday were stunned when they found a mother and her newborn baby lying on the tile floor. Fortunately, there is a happy ending. His eyes open. Carla Batiste is now healthy and happy with her newborn son, Christian. It's a huge blessing considering their journey just one day ago. He was crying and breathing okay, but still I was scared. Like, there's no one here to help us. The mother of three went into labor just after midnight yesterday morning. St. Luke's Hospital in Overland Park sent her home because they say she wasn't dilated enough and her water hadn't broke. Neither mattered to Christian. Yep, no help. He just came right on out. He said, I'm ready to be here. Within minutes of getting back home, Batiste said Christian had arrived. She nor her husband were ready. I was like, oh my God, catch him. I was like growling. I was like, Arr! and then it came out. So did your husband catch Christian? No. <laughs> what was he doing? On the phone with no one, one of my doctor pacing back and forth. We were, we were a little taken back. Firefighter Stephen Graves had given Batiste and her husband a ride to the hospital the first time that night. Okay, I'm sorry. Now, just two and a half hours later, the baby was here. All six pounds, nine ounces of him, born on hallway linoleum. When Graves arrived with his fire team moments later, as a trained EMT, he knew what to do before the ambulance got there. We made sure that we were, were hearing sounds from the baby. We got the umbilical cord clamped so that it could be cut once the ambulance came in. Batiste thanks the firefighters for keeping her calm during a very scary situation. Yeah, we just really, really appreciate everybody that's being there for us. It's created a special bond between all three. I said the baby, that's my new nephew now. <laughs> but that doesn't quite mean they're ready for a repeat. No more babies. Uh -uh. <laughs> Batiste says her other two children had very short labors as well. Again, there's no plans for a fourth. In KCMO, Josh Elmuth, 41 Action News.